What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Monkey Flop here and today I wanted to talk about the lawsuit that's going on with PlayStation 3. Now, not too many news outlets are talking about this, not too many YouTubers are talking about it, but I thought it was notable to bring up to you guys because you could be one step closer to getting $55 put back into your pockets. Now let's go ahead and discuss this. If you guys are familiar with the PlayStation 3, back in the day you were able to run other OS features. Uh, a lot of people run Linux, and that is what the lawsuit is all about. So listen up, because this could get either $9 or $55 put back into your pocket. So before we get any further, let's go ahead and get right into it. So Sony's troubles began with the PlayStation 3 software update 3.21. On March 28, 2010, Sony announced the update would disable... They install other features that was available on the PlayStation 3 prior to the current slimmer models. This feature Sony claimed would be removed due to security concerns, although the lawsuit alleged that piracy was the main reason. At one point, Sony claimed that the terms of service allowed it to remove the other OS feature Sony also said the functionality wasn't a big deal and most uh, console owners wouldn't even care. But we all know the gaming community, right? A lot of people were PO'd about it. A lot of people raised their voices and a lawsuit was created. So here's the, here's the whole scheme of things. PlayStation 3 disabled a feature that a lot of people used and a lot of people loved. Uh, they got upset, filed the lawsuit. So... If you live in the United States or lived in the United States or even purchased a PlayStation 3 from the United States, you purchased the FAT model, and this was between November 1st, 2006 and April 1st of 2010. If you purchase your console between that time frame, you will be eligible. Now... To get the $55, uh, you must be able to obtain a proof of purchase and installation of Linux. Uh, you got to provide proof of purchase of their purchase or serial number and a PlayStation Network sign-in ID. You must submit uh, some sort of proof that you used the other functionality. To get the $9, okay, so that's for the $55. To get the $9 on this lawsuit, uh, PlayStation 3 owners must submit a claim that at the time they bought their console, they knew about the other OS, relied upon it for the other OS functionality, and intended to use the other OS functionality. So basically, if you purchased a PlayStation 3 between... Uh, 2006 to 2010, uh, you might be eligible for the $9. Now, if you can provide proof with a PlayStation Network sign-in ID, installation of Linux, and a proof of purchase for your PlayStation 3, then you'll be eligible for the $55. Um, so that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think about this because I will be curious as to know in the comment section below. I will include all the links in the video description. So if you guys are curious, you guys want to read up a little bit more about it. I will link you to the article where I get this information from. I really thought it was a good idea to bring this up to you guys because I know there's a lot of uh, hardcore uh, PlayStation fans. And I know a lot of people purchase their console between, um, I know... A lot of my fans have purchased a PlayStation 3 back in the day. And some of you guys even purchased a fat PlayStation 3. And you might be eligible for this either $9 or $55. So, again, let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section below. If you would hit a like, that really helps me out. If you guys haven't already subscribed, that would be awesome as well. I keep you guys up to date on all of the latest PlayStation 4, PlayStation Plus news updates, all that good stuff. So you don't have to make sure to share this on Facebook, Twitter, whatever social media platform you guys use. So that way we can spread the news that this... Uh, lawsuit is going on and you might be eligible for either nine dollars or fifty five dollars anyways that's it for me you guys are freaking awesome